Back in 2007, Steve Jobs railed against using a stylus with a smartphone. Who wants a stylus? You have to get them and put them away and you lose them, yuck. Nobody wants a stylus, so let's not use a stylus. So they turned a lot of heads this year when they released the new Apple Pencil, a stylus designed for the iPad Pro. Why the change of heart? Here's why. Until now, third-party styluses basically acted as a replacement for your finger, which by nature is imprecise. The Apple Pencil, on the other hand, is much more precise. The iPad Pro screen is designed to communicate with the Apple Pencil and detect various levels of pressure, and it can even detect when you're shading on the side just like a real pencil. And since the iPad Pro is designed with professionals in mind, a lot of graphic designers are going to be using this device and they need that kind of precision in order to make the apps work better. But of course, there's gonna be a catch. The Apple Pencil doesn't come with the iPad Pro, and like many other Apple products, it's pretty expensive. It's gonna cost you an extra $100 on top of the $799 the iPad Pro costs. So the big takeaway here is, when you look back at Steve Jobs' famous rant against styluses, Yuck. he was actually talking about using them on a small screen phone. On bigger screen devices like the iPad Pro, it makes a lot more sense to have that level of precision only a stylus can give you.